is the Tango. 41 inches wide. It looks like there's a lot of unusual controls in here, a little bit, a little bit kind of more advanced than my G-Wiz. So tell me a bit about this car, York. It's, it's pretty amazing. I, 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 the, the width is just brilliant. <laughs> if you fit in, it's snug, but it's, it's comfortable. Yeah. Yeah, yeah actually, if, you, uh, if, if you're sitting in a regular car, the distance from you to you know, whatever door is nearest you is the same in that car as it is in this car. So as far as uh, creature comforts and how you feel in the front seat, it's just like any other car. completely stable all the time when you drive it. You, you never feel like you're going to roll it because it, your natural tendency is to think it's going to roll on a corner this thing. Yeah, uh, it, it does lean quite a bit as you go through a curve and of course it's, I'm leaning in the wrong direction. Um, and so your, your instincts are that it feels like it's going to flip over but after a while you, you just get used to the fact that it isn't. Uh, that it isn't going to roll. Yeah. Have you got gears? No. Single drive forward. Single drive forward. So give me some spec, York. How, how fast? How far? I know. I know it's fast, but you, tell tell me about it. So the the uh, maximum range on is about 40 to 5 to 50 miles. Uh, it's geared for a maximum of 150 miles an hour. Uh, but, in, but in real world, that means you could probably go a, a max of about 130 miles per hour. Um, I haven't actually tried it at that speed yet. I've only gone as fast as about 110 so far. <laughs> Um, let's see, fast to 0 to 60 in a little over 4 seconds, and uh, does the quarter mile in about 12 and a half. The, um, tell me, uh, what battery technology is it running on? So this one's actually a lead acid. Yeah. Uh, they're, they're trying to switch over to lithium ion, but they, uh, they need a good battery supplier and, uh, and somebody knows how to properly design a battery controller for, their, for that lithium ion pack. The, the funny thing is, and, and really the great thing, um, on a normal, gas, or a normal electric car, uh, the, the batteries pose a problem because there's so much weight. And uh, what they did is, in, in this car, they actually served a very important purpose. All of the batteries are actually underneath the floor. And so, and all of that weight is basically being used as ballast to keep the car upright. So you can actually take this thing and park it on a 45 degree angle and it still wouldn't fall over. 